hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome to my channel i'm sydney if you're new i honestly don't know if this lighting is good my hair i never curl it and i obviously curled it today i want it to just look like messy that's not the point of this video this video is going to be an everyday makeup routine i'm just going to do like a really chill version i'm like i don't want my channel to be this big production so if you're here for a production that's not what you're gonna get i'm filming this on my iphone um also regarding my nails i broke these two i broke this one like right after i got my nails done it was tragic literally the day after um i hated it and then i broke this one the other day and my thumb so before you come to me and are like your nails are disgusting what the fuck i'm going to get them done on wednesday also some of these products don't go buy them don't be like because i'm using them i'm just using them because that's what i have and i don't want to go waste my money that i shouldn't be spending on makeup on makeup when i have stuff that works that doesn't mean it's the best thing ever if I, if I genuinely think it's the best thing ever, I will tell you. I put this in my hair, and I'm praying it doesn't, like, mess it up, you know? Okay, first order of business. Um, clear brow gel. I saw this thing where it's, like, you shouldn't buy clear brow gel. You should just use hairspray for some reason. Also, my mirror's here, so if I, like, look over here, that's why. I think I can do this without looking. Oh, my God. As I poke myself in the eye, pretty much. Um, I saw a video on TikTok. Where else would it be? That, like, basically said if you're... Oh, if you're using brow gel, you're wasting your money. It's just use hairspray. But I feel like hairspray would break me out. I literally just brush my brows up like a crazy fluffy brow Instagram queen. And it doesn't really matter how unruly they are. You're also then going to take, I use this, use a brush, use whatever, like the back of a, like the handle of a brush. And you're just going to flatten them down. And it's going to look like you laminated them. Could you just go get your brows laminated? Yes. I'm literally an esthetician. Could I just laminate my own brows? Yes. But I'm always wearing makeup when I'm at my office. So I don't laminate them. Now I'm going to take... The brow is. This was Anastasia, by the way. Did I tell you that? Like, it's not... You don't need this. You could go to the... Don't get clear... Does my sister have hers here? Don't go get clear mascara from Maybelline. Don't work. It really doesn't work. That's why I got that. Um, I just got the little mini one. It was like $12. And I'll tell you how long it lasts in the future. Then I literally... I try to straighten this brow out because this brow is straighter. I don't know if you can tell that. Like, go through them. I don't do anything crazy because again natural I don't want blocky looking eyebrows when I first bought this again so literally less than a month ago I was doing some ugly ass shit and it wasn't cute like literally that's good she's cute she's natural she's nothing crazy I just fill in a gap the gap so it doesn't look crazy and I also like straighten like this part out probably do it a little more there because I shaved that part of my eyebrow off you can brush it out if you want it's obviously going to be laid down but you don't want to do this part first you want to do the clear brow gel that's just how I do it and if you're going to follow my steps you might as well actually follow them what's like the most ridiculous thing you do your makeup for like I'm going grocery shopping with my boyfriend I feel like that's honestly like an okay thing but if you know where I live my hometown it's not necessary it's really not. Now, green concealer. I'm only going to use this. Do I even have my brush with me? I'm only going to use this right on these two. That's it. I'm going to let it sit there for a bit because that's what I like to do. And while I do that, I'm going to take... I lost one of my concealers. Like this... I use literally this concealer in... Just wait. I also have it in like a contour shade. Mind you, I'm a, like if you're coming here and you're gonna comment, oh you did this wrong, fuck off. Um, because I am an esthetician and I learned makeup artistry, if you want to call it that. 
Like, I went to school for this. Do they teach me how to do my makeup like this? No, I don't listen to what, really what they taught me. <laughs> um, I have been doing makeup for people since I was... 17? 18? 17? 17. Um, I did prom makeup. Literally. For my friends, I did, yeah, prom makeup. And then I did a girl's wedding. And it was a blast and a half. Do you see how just, like, lifted and, like, snatched those brows look? Okay. Now I blend this out with my finger. So the shade I just used to like carve out my brows and stuff was porcelain. When I'm really pale. I don't think you understand, this is me quite self-tanned. And I'm, well I self-tanned once, but it was with ultra dark. I'm literally like light ivory. Can only use it today. Tomorrow I'll be too pale to use this and get away with it. Uh, like, it's ridiculous. Uh, I have a little acne acne there. I just like go over and cover my spots. I like how you literally just said, I'm a makeup artist. And I'm just like, you know, do I like do makeup a lot? No, because I don't know. I get, I'm a perfectionist. And at the same time, makeup is such a like personal thing that I get scared to do other people's makeup because I'm like if you don't like it it's not anything against me because I'm gonna like it if I do it I'm gonna like it on you I'm not gonna just give you something I don't like and then be like you know I like sort of covered it <laughs> um I just like a naturally cute look you know like not then again don't get it twisted. I'm not like, oh, I don't wear a lot of makeup. Like, if I want to go glam, I will go glam. I will fake lash, cut crease, a bitch. But I just don't do that every day. Also, I never showed you. I do use sunscreen. This is what I use. If you have any melanin in your skin, do not use this. Um, it is white. White. I know, like, most sunscreens are because they're a scam, but... I, it, I don't know what they were thinking. Okay, next up, some blush. This product, go get this product. If you take one product from this video, honestly, let it be this one. Because Selena Gomez, it's the rare beauty, so it's Selena Gomez's stuff. And I am the biggest Justin Bieber fan ever so we're not like this is a little controversial but she and I like Haley that's another thing to keep in mind but when I tell you she slapped with this shit I honestly didn't even need as much as I just used like do you see how pigmented this shit is I'm kind of scared now I also put this on before my concealer because I just go ham with this stuff and if I put my concealer on first then I like go over this and I have like a red eye red under eye so also put it like really high up on your face and don't like just you know my phone is dead ass trying to scare me right now by like stopping filming because like there's not enough storage and so I just went and deleted stuff I put that little bit on my nose because I like it. It's kind of the whole premise of everything I'm doing right now. Okay. This is going to be a little harder. Oh, girl. To do. Because it's over here. I'm kind of digging this headband. Also, I got the lightest shade in the dewy color. And, like, it's not very light. I got, I, I'm using shade um, Joy. I'll have everything linked down below because I'm a real one and I'm gonna do that. Also, if you can see like the remnants of pink 
in my hair I have like a pink section in my hair but I haven't had it redone in forever I'm also doing that Wednesday Wednesday I'm just gonna be like the baddest bitch possible are you kidding I'm also I think I'm gonna go thrift shopping thrift shopping is that's what it's called right why can't I I used to work at a thrift store that was literally like it's a big part of my personality <laughs> cute already already just okay this is the lightest possible shade of this stuff um if you're canadian they sell this at lawton's uh, a lot of people don't know that if you did i'm sorry to tell you um a lot of my friends are like whoa hold up you got that at lawton's and i'm like yeah that's where i got it okay that's kind of how i do my concealer every day is a, a different uh technique honestly this is like not a tutorial this is just showing you what i do and if you like it do it try it you know what i mean live your best life this is my face not yours oh my god we have baby chicks in my class in my class i'm not in school i'm 21 by the way let's just talk about this i'm 21 i live with my parents um so if you could subscribe please because I have more. Oh. If you could subscribe, that'd be great. Because um, I work for myself, which is fabulous. And I'm, I'm making that coin. I also only work for myself two days a week. So, like, making coin two days a week. And, like, some days are, like, super amazing and busy. And I'm literally booked my entire day. And some days I have, like, one client. So, take everything with a grain of salt, but I would never change what I'm doing right now for the world. I work two days a week with my mother. Um, she's a pre-primary teacher. I, I help her out two days a week because someone else helps her out. I just got that everywhere. Someone else helps her out every other day of the week. This is an eyeshadow brush. This is a blending brush from Lower Tree, but I just use it for translucent powder. I just love how, like, my boyfriend every Monday doesn't know what he's gonna get. I could show up no makeup on in a raggedy old bun, or I could show up, like, looking like this. He doesn't know, because I don't work on Mondays. Well, I do, but just, like, on this type of stuff, if you call this work. I'm not getting paid for this, but I like it. It's fun. Okay, so, working with my mom. Um, I work with her two days a week in a pre-primary classroom, and this is bronzer. This is a product, like, just buy a bronzer that's nice. Um, if you have a nice bronzer that's not orange, um, but not, like, mucky, let me know. Anyway, um, so I work with my mom in a pre-primary class, and we have chickens, and, like, I never thought I'd be the type to be, like, oh, my God, a chicken. You know? But, oh, my God. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. I never thought that I would, like, be so in love with chickens ever. They're so cute. I'm going to, like, up, like add pictures of these chickens to the screen. They're, like, they're just so cute. And... I'm just thoroughly excited for tomorrow because I get to go see them. I feel like my bronzer is like not doing what I want it to do. I go back in with my brow stuff too, by the way. The secret sauce of this look is this dew setting spray. Use whichever you choose, but this is my favorite. I'm also looking for a good like actual highlighter because I don't have any... My boyfriend's always like, what the fuck are you doing? And I sprayed this on his, like, shoulder the other day after he got out of the shower. He's like, what the fuck is that? Is it gonna stay on me all day? I'm like, yes, but, like, not gonna do anything. And obviously I do mascara before someone's like, your lashes. But I'm just letting this dry first, and I wanted to get my hair out. I'm gonna recurl those front pieces really quick. Like, that's still there. I just wanna fix this. So I put mascara on one eye 
can tell. I just use this. It doesn't even have the label on it anymore. I've had this eyelash curler. This is the first one I've ever had, and I still have it. It's Victoria's Secret, and it's honestly the best one I've ever used. Obviously, I've used other people's, and I used to be a dancer when I was a kid. And do you know how many strangers eyelash curlers I used? Too many to count. Disgusting, I know. My genuine opinion is, like, just go get eyelash extensions. But, like I was saying before, I live with my parents, so why would I get eyelash extensions if I can't live on my own, you know? And people, like, try to use that, like, against me. They're like, you have a business, but, like, you don't even live by yourself, so, like, blah, 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 blah. You don't even live by yourself, so, like, you can't be doing that good. First of all, there's, like, this little thing that happened called fucking coronavirus, and I was off work. And you might be like, you're Canadian, you got served. I didn't. People just like to be haters, and I'm just like, literally, why? You're just making yourself more worked up than I am, so. I want to do a quick, like, lip gloss do a quick lip gloss I sometimes do that I usually use just like the Laneige lip mask um my favorite lip liner if I want to go crazy and wild I literally just saw it it's by the brand um Bodyography and it's in the shade barely there and it is beautiful Ooh, OG moment I'm sure there's a dupe anyway that's my everyday makeup routine. Nothing crazy. Please subscribe, like I said, so that I can get eyelash extensions and move out of my parents' house. And I'm not going to work with my mom starting in when school's over. So June. So I'm going to probably start doing four days a week at my like aesthetics business. But like, still. I'd like another form of income and social media I'm just funny so I should be able to do that way anyway, thank you for watching this video I'll see you in my next one